Tonight in Medical Rounds, knowing if you're at risk for breast cancer, how do you know when you should get a mammogram? Tonight, you can get all of your questions answered at the Hospital of Central Connecticut's Cancer Institute Open House, which is starting in just a few minutes. And joining us live to explain more is Dr. Camelia Lawrence, a breast surgeon at the Hartford Healthcare Cancer Institute. Good evening, Dr. Lawrence. Thanks for spending some time with us tonight. Good evening. Uh, you have the event tonight where women can come to the Cancer Center and hear you speak, but there's also more going on there. What's happening? We are excited to showcase our comprehensive state-of-the-art breast center here in Plainville and all the wonderful services that we have available for the management of the breast cancer patient. We are proud to partner with the Alpha Kappa Sorority to invite the community to join us in learning more about the importance of screening mammography, early detection, treatment option, as well as the diagnosis of breast cancer. In fact, one in eight women will be impacted by breast cancer over the course of their lifetime, and Connecticut in particular has one of the higher rates in the country. The center here houses all the latest treatments available for the management of the breast patient, as well as a multidisciplinary team of experts. Well, it sounds very comprehensive there and caring in your approach. I understand there's another speaker tonight, and what will she be talking about? Yes, we're joined by Ms. Shanine uh, Armstrong. She's actually a member of the Alpha Kappa sorority who received her care here within the Hartford Healthcare System, and she'll be talking about her journey with breast cancer and the importance of early diagnosis and treatment. Mammography saves lives. Yes, it does. And Dr. Lawrence, we have a few seconds left, and I have to ask you, because I always like to end on a hopeful note. Where is breast cancer research and treatment going? What's next? Well, researchers always explore new ways for the management of the breast patient to improve quality of life. One of the types of breast cancer that we deal with is called triple negative breast cancer. and We're currently exploring new targets for treating triple negative breast cancer, such as kinase inhibitors and immunotherapy. Well, wonderful. You keep up the great work there, Dr. Lawrence. We thank you for this information. And if you